the idea that you never knew anything. Because the things that you already know, you will repeat and you will regurgitate and nothing new will ever come from that. We're engulfed in this very bizarre revolution of communication. Advertising was going to move from a place of yelling at people, interrupting people. Whatever was going to be next, it was going to need to be done by people who see the world differently. And that's what artists have always done. You build something so compelling, so engaging, that people come to it to be a part of it. Well, that's what modern marketing and advertising is. Strategy has always been war-based. Marketing is about winning and beating competition and taking market share. It's like, well, how does artistic thinking fit in strategy that's always been war-based? A recent definition of strategy says a maneuver in a game or conversation. It took this idea of winning into actually being more about keeping the conversation going. And that's what art has always been. Art has been about getting people to have conversations. You have to take drawing. Drawing teaches you about negative space. Negative space is the stuff that's all around us that we don't know how to see until we're trained to see it. And suddenly, oh, there's all this stuff. And that's what insights are. Drawing is observation. Drawing is about seeing the world differently. And that's what planners do. Once you see, that's when creativity starts. But don't let it be poisoned by the things you already see on the computer. They're already kind of given to you. I'm not teaching traditional advertising. I'm teaching people how to observe what's around them and the history of the universe. Facebook and Twitter just were agreed to me. Put your head in the corner. That's where you get ideas from. Not from looking at a computer. Okay, go look, take a look at some of the architecture that's been done. Go look at the way the molecules operate. Go look at the way the super strings operate. Go look at, look at the way different cultures interact with one another. Educating yourself to have the potential to generate uh, different ideas. So you always question established systems. And the more educated you are about how things operate in the universe, the more you can knowledge of social establishments come up with a new way An art school is less about answers and more about questions and it's going to create this sort of curiosity and that's the great thing right thinking like an artist means you have to be curious you know a little bit about everything and then there are certain things that you are very good at well here you know all these artistic endeavors gives you the opportunity to kind of touch a little piece of them refuse to do traditional advertising Born. You know, the Prius versus the six day Charger RT. One's designed by one guy with a vision, the other one's designed by a committee of people. Kind of in all of business, the idea is we, we are what we make, people who do interesting things and can bring it into the world of advertising, rather than people who are interested in the world of advertising. We were training people to, to build things in a much more aesthetic um, way, whether it's industrial design where you're making an actual product and baking whatever interestingness you find into it or or if it is you know more visual like a painting or a drawing class and getting you to observe the world and, and, and show it to people. Planning is inherently creative. If you can stay present in this moment it's going to help you in terms of being able to observe and notice the details, the message, the emotion, the connection, and the honesty to show up for who you are, I think is really important in terms of getting buy-in from the audience and really getting a sense that you're not trying to bullshit them. Training people that think like in terms of advertising is stupid. Training people that think in terms of observing and taking in the world and filtering it through their brains, their hearts, and their instinctual guts and then conveying it in an interesting way, that's powerful.